How to get out from Iron 3. Okay, Gaming with Gamer, I'm gonna show you 5 tips how you can climb out of low elo. These tips not only work for Iron players, but also for silver and bronze. But boys, girls, I want to show you one thing. <laughs> Look at this clip. But before that, I want to thank you all. We almost hit 80 subscribers. So we hit 80 subscribers, I guess. And we got that one month ago, exactly one month ago. And now we are at, I, I don't even know where we at. Where are we at? Ah, we are at 3.85k subscribers. Holy, uh, thank you all. All right, let's hop into the first tip. So the first tip I can give you is know the Valorant basics. And with basics, I mean movement and shooting. I will give you now a very quick run through of the basics. First thing I see everyone in Iron doing wrong is do something like this. Can you guess what's wrong? I don't know what's wrong, what's wrong? Well, let me tell it a lot clearer. Do you know now what's wrong? Okay, if you didn't notice already, I see most people aiming way too much down or way too much up. Don't do that. Aim always where the head could be. If you don't know where the head could be, it's right straight ahead. But you can also knife uh, right in the wall and then you know where the head of the enemy could be. Just don't knife like really in the game. But if you really don't know, just do it once and you know it. Uh, because the enemy will hear you and that's just... Don't, don't knife mid in the middle of the round, okay? Okay, now spray control. You can just shoot and don't do anything because then that will happen. As you are seeing, the spray goes up and you don't want that to happen. So you have to aim down and then a little bit to the left and the right if you want to spray. It goes a little bit like this. And with the Phantom, it's a little bit easier in my opinion. If you are going for long range shots, I would not recommend spraying because it's very hard to spray from long range. I would recommend uh, just tap fire or burst fire. Burst fire is the best, but it can be hard. So uh, start with tap firing. If you can do that, then burst fire. And if you can do that, then spray. And the very last thing you should know is that if you are aiming, your fire rate goes down. So it's better to not aim. But if you can't aim, then just aim. It's like per preferences. All the pros do not aim because the fire rate is better, but uh, it's just one thing to keep in mind, you know? I don't know about you guys, but I hate doing warm-ups and I hate practicing. And I never, honestly never practiced my aiming, but uh, what I did was always do one or two deathmatch warm-ups. And a lot of people don't realize it, but a warm-up is a practice. So if you do one or two deathmatch games before your first game, of the day then you are getting better and aping you are practicing so do your warm-ups and honestly i think aim lab it's very good to practice or just the workshop of valorant but it's so boring <laughs> and i got to uh, high diamond without using those uh, practices so you don't have to just do your warm-ups that's all i'm saying so for those who follow me a little bit longer do you remember this one Yeah, this kid said a lot of more mean things to me. Uh, <laughs> I deleted that old video because it was just not really family friendly. So a big tip I can give you is play with friends. And if you <laughs> if you don't have friends, uh, <clears throat> then you should uh, look for friends. Like if you find people fun to play with, just add them and ask if they want to play again. And it really helps you climbing. Another tip I want to give you is that you should not play another agent every game. Just try to main one, two or three agents. On my main account I only play Jet, Killjoy and Sofa here and there. And sometimes maybe Omen, but not more, you know. And on my Smurfs I play all the other agents. So if you want to climb with one account, just main one or two agents and be the best at it. And one thing I see a lot of people doing wrong is looking at team comps because honestly at this rank team comps do not matter so if you teammate saying play sage play sage don't play sage if you can't play sage just play a race and make 30 kills instead of playing sage and maybe going back because you never play her you know and the last thing i want to tell you is that it's all about the attitude just 
always stay calm don't rage on your teammates and we know i know all your teammates are bad because that's just a thing but don't rage at them and stay positive have fun have fun is the most important thing and eventually 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 i i'm, I'm bad at english sorry um, you will get there i promise so this is the end of this video uh if you want to know a little bit more about the basics i got a video about how to shoot through smokes and wall bang like a wall hacker you can click on that video on the left and subscribe and like yo peace